what would you guys take? Would you take the bin? Uh, the bin's cracked. The door, that's a hollow core door. That wouldn't make a very good uh, sidewalk. Take the oil dry, never been used. Another house for sale. <laughs> Obviously, I'll take the vacuum. How about the chair? This is just scrap. the heck that's for a little piece of tin the chair looks like it's in good shape though would it do good in a yard sale is to learn how to not get stuff chewed up. So maybe if I learn a technique, I don't know, maybe we could, we could have a garage sale or a yard sale over by my uh, in-laws or something, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe I'll come back on my pickup to get that. I don't really see some other scrapper grabbing it. Then again, you never know. I actually got people commenting on all the crud that's on the floor. That's from that's from scrapping. Things are dirty when you go and pick them up. Like, look at the wheelbarrow. Even after you knock some of it off. After a while, the crud builds up. Onward. A little bit of scraps over here. Every little bit adds up, right? Every last little bit. Get it all. <laughs> oh, wow. One of those. Looks like one of those tents. No, I guess it's a trampoline or something. Or a pool. Ah, it's a pool. Kind of. Some autocast. It's all good stuff. Let's 
kill that squawk box. We're in between stations, so it... That's a lot of steel. Got myself a tripod here. Like I'm in slow motion or something. Wow, almost four minutes so far. Jeez, that's too long, man. You need a tripod. Doesn't work for uh, for that purpose. Woo.
out of shape. I don't know, I, I think I have to weigh step it up. Because as much as I lift and I do, I don't uh, seem like I get any stronger. Oh wow. Yeah, deliberately. Looks like it was deliberately smashed. Don't it? How does something like this get like a dent in it? I gotta grab that because that's the kind of thing that people will run back out and go, I'm keeping that. Okay, we got a radio here. Oh wow, look at that, it's got a remote control. I've selling this before for five bucks. What could I do with it? I guess I could put it up front here in my van. Probably could reuse it, right? That don't look bad. I 
I was thinking about this after like 10,000 comments. I see, the thing is, you know, about having like a garage sale or finding enough crap for like a flea market. I keep watching those uh, scrap farm videos. Guy's pretty good, man. Even taco snacks. He picks up those uh, plastic bins and stuff like that. I guess they're resellable. They don't usually survive transit, though, in the scrap life, you know what I mean? That's a problem. Just half the battle is getting this stuff to uh, survive transit. Onward, on to the next, or on to the next video. See you later, guys.